uh, being here today. Uh, what Representative Rogner articulated uh, sums up the purpose of this. This is all about transparency. Uh, when citizens uh, are going to the ballot box and looking to uh, vote uh, on a, a certain issue, whether it's a state issue, local issue, what have you, they have the right to know what they're voting on A and B. They have the right to know what's the full picture of debt uh, in their local municipality, in their school district, in their state, what have you. And this shines sunlight uh, on the uh, debt picture uh, so uh, citizens can know how much debt there is in their community, how much debt there is in their state uh, when making uh, important decisions uh, for, for bonds in the local areas and also uh, throughout the state. Uh, this uh, piggybacks on the transparency initiatives we've done in the Treasurer's Office in the past. Uh, in the past, we've taken uh, public employees, uh, salary data and other information, put it on our website, leverage technology to uh, make public information more accessible to citizens, and this just builds upon that initiative. Uh, I'd like to applaud Representative Rogner for really taking the uh, lead, drafting this, and doing the research. Uh, we provided in your packet a, a sample ballot. Uh, this sample ballot uh, illustrates what a ballot will look like today, and then uh, tomorrow this legislation uh, passed and essentially just gives more information to taxpayers uh, when they're walking the ballot box and closing that curtain. Uh, I'm going to uh, allow uh, the other representatives up here to say a couple words because at the end of the day, uh, this legislation uh, will be a creature of the legislature. Uh, this is something that the legislature will have to debate and discuss uh, here in the House and eventually hopefully in the Senate. And so I'm going to allow these uh, representatives here to uh, take a couple minutes and talk about why they're uh, co-sponsoring it as it's introduced this week. Uh, thanks uh, to the press for coming out this morning. We appreciate it, uh, Representative Rogner. Thanks for your leadership on this important issue. Uh, you know, here in Columbus, we're blessed with uh, a lot of press looking over our shoulder and uh, really holding us, I think, accountable to the debt load of the state. And I see a great need at the local government level to have some uh, additional light to be shined on the debt loads of our local governments. We may live in a multi-jurisdictional uh, community where we have school levies and uh, maybe a bond levy to pay off water lines, sewer lines, and so on. And I think it's very important that uh, the constituents that we serve have uh, as much knowledge about what the true debt load is that they're carrying on their tax shoulders, so to speak. So Representative Rogner, thanks for your leadership on this important issue. 